All right, guys, what's going on? It's Knock. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today, we're going to play Osmosis from Asias 16. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. I'd really appreciate the support. But without further ado, let's jump into the description. Easy, medium, difficulty, mono portal featuring a funnel and a laser. Taking a month off of July from portal, I am back with a new puzzle. I decided to return to mono portal after not making any for several months, and I am pleased with the result. Please note the white fizzler is a closed solid field. It basically acts as a toggleable wall. It blocks portals, objects, lasers, and the player from passing through it. Thanks to nobody for playtesting. Uh, music is self-esteem fun from portal one. As always, feedback is appreciated. And yeah, let them know if you found anything. A couple of fixes. All right, without further ado, let's jump in. Oh no, whatever will I do? Where can I go? Through here. This is where I go. Okay, interesting. Laser will turn that off. So it will temporarily grant me full access. Oh, there's another way down here. Although that is a return path, it looks like, for this direction, so it's not very helpful. At the moment. All right, we can go back into there. I kind of monopole puzzles sometimes disorient me because obviously you just go through the puzzle in sort of like blind faith, and you don't always know um, where you sort of come from. If that makes sense. You don't always see where the mono portal. Um, I don't know what you call it, mono portal base. I, I don't really know what you call it. You know what I mean? I think you know what I mean. Sure, you know what I mean. I'm sure you do. All right. Anyway, that was not the right thing to do. Let's go back. Maybe this will be the right thing to do. We'll jump down here. Most people are starting to use um, what seems like faster um, faster funnels just recently. Okay, just an observation. So now that we have a reverse funnel, oh, it also turns that off. Well, that's quite handy. That's quite handy indeed. All right, so cube number two. Dot get. Excuse me. Um, okay, we'll go across there. There's a button over there which we need to push. The time has come to push that button. Uh, that's on for ages. Oh, I did it. I inadvertently did that in time. Um, okay. But now... Whilst I have done that, the one thing... The 
question is, how do I get... How do I get the other cube? So... Should that have been turn path? Should that have been the cube swapped? Hmm. Oh, okay. Yep. I see. Said the blind man. Clever, very clever. Although it wasn't so clever. It's the fact that I just got that stuck in there. <laughs> Alright, let's try that again, shall we? There we go, and that will go all the way through there, onto the button, and there. So yeah, nice, cool stuff this is. Um, I, that's a key observation. I know you've got signage and everything there, but I didn't notice it straight away. Oh, uh, I thought it was like an extra requirement. I just looked over here, I was like looking around, I was like, okay, there's an extra requirement to block a laser there, and I was like, oh, that's the window. Oh, that's where that fridge. So yeah, kind of fitted together quite nice. So, so yeah, good puzzle, I quite enjoyed that. Good to have you back, Sears. And uh, look forward to seeing more from you in the near future, guys. Thank you very much for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any more slides to pay, please leave them in the comments over to my Google form. I'll link to that is in the description. But until next time, I've been Hawk. You've been awesome. See ya.